What's up guys, it's Michael here. I'm just chilling in the office with my Monster Energy drink and the Steelers jerseys in the corner. Um, can't really flip the camera around because it's I'm recording in, on my iPhone. Um, doing another update. Don't really know where to go with my next videos. I have a couple series that I want to bring back. Story time is always going to be there. Band-Aids is also always going to be there. I just want to clarify one thing. The Band-Aids solo videos that I do, they are they are my, uh, th there's a solo Band-Aids video of my opinion and, you know, stuff like that and everything and this and that. And, yeah, so the actual hour-long un raw untouched footage for Band-Aids is not going to begin until we get back into marching band camp. We may not have a season. or We, we may, we, we might just have to follow different precautions and we might be back in school by the time that the band camp rolls around i really don't know i don't know um but the only perks of that is um our principal is letting people from seventh grade that are going to be eighth graders join the band again because with the 15 seniors that are graduating we we, we, we would only have 45 people in the band when we originally had 60 so that's what's going on there and I did delete Band-Aids episode 7 because I think I did go a little bit too far on criticizing the person who uh, I was talking talking about. And that that episode, I just used that to attack somebody. And I'm, I'm sorry for that, I guess. It really wasn't uh, supposed to be like that. I, I had a whole... I had, like, every time there's news, I, I put, like, I, I put in my memos in my iPhone. And I just... I read i type about it and i put what i'm gonna say and i put this and that um but i can't pull that up when i'm recording because all the videos are going to be on my iphone so yeah and i i i'm not gonna redo episode seven so you guys are gonna see uh uh um a jump from episode six to episode eight um yeah and i i am working on a very special project for you guys coming out whenever um it's 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 another fan movie type thing and it's 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 a it's 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 a, it's a type of a war movie but it's you know, it's a, surrounded around one um cinematic movie character so um and you guys know that i was in the uh bloomsburg theater ensemble from when i was in kindergarten i think all the way up until fifth grade um, so yeah, that was pretty much where we'd work for a month and we'd put on this theater show. And so that involved acting, of course. So that's why I do all these fan things. You guys saw, um, Battle of Hatergan did really good. Uh, the one before that when it was me and Gavin and it was in the snowstorm and it was about World War Two. Both of those war films are about World War Two. They both did really good. Uh, a lot of people out of like the 50 some people who watched it really liked it uh, so yeah thank you guys all for that I know that was a while ago and I'm just addressing it now but oh well so that's pretty much all I wanted to say on that accord uh, this is an update it's almost 5 a.m. see you guys all in the next video